Hello friends, welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. I'm Taylor, I'm also known as Trixie, and it's Thursday. It's, fuck, what day is it? February 20th, which means I've been gone for a long fucking time and I'm super fucking sorry. Um, kind of just took a little detour to bring us back to right here. Um, I just kind of needed a little mental break, a little, I don't know, I'm sorry because I feel like in true bootleg Amberlynn Reed fashion, I'm pulling a fucking Amberlynn. Um, except I have stayed pretty much on track. I did have two unfortunate bullshit slip ups. One of which wasn't really unfortunate. It was kind of my own personal test, but it was also a very, very celebratory thing for a dear friend of mine who has gone and made some fucking kick-ass changes in her life and is doing boss bitch things and taking care of her and her family and got herself out of a situation. And that is, I did a shot of Patron with her. One shot. Today, it's the 20th, so it's officially day 51. In 51 days, I have taken one shot of tequila. I'm bummed that I did it after the fact, but in the moment, it really did seem right, and so whatever. The other thing is, is the day after that, that was on Valentine's Day. I did not get home until like 2.30 in the morning. I didn't go to sleep until probably 4 and then had to wake back up. I ended up sleeping in and deciding to take an Uber to work and in that process forgot to fucking wait in. And then I ended up, we were so busy at work that I picked up a shift that night and I didn't get home again until after 1.30 in the morning. So I couldn't even do like a end of the night Saturday wait in. So the 15th? I will, yeah, the 15th. I don't have a weigh in for the 15th. I have a weigh in for every other day. I'm gonna put all those in here. I'm gonna tell you all my steps. But I think I'm gonna save that till the very end because I, first of all, want to thank you if you're even still willing to watch me because I do, in fact, feel like poo for basically fucking up everything in this challenge except for the one thing which is I have not strayed from being plant-based. So, at least there's that. I'm here to get back with it. I do have some super, and part of why I'm coming back today, I was gonna upload yesterday, it didn't end up happening, I got distracted, got in cleaning mode, was catching up on my YouTube stories from the weekend. I got a new tattoo on Tuesday. That's exciting, right? It's fucking huge, it hurt a lot. This bitch, uh-uh. I always thought I wanted to be like really cool and get like a spider web tattoo here, like all the fucking old biker people do. Probably not gonna happen. Um so in the time that I've been gone, I did a shot of tequila. I worked a fuck ton over Valentine's Day weekend. Um I got a tattoo. That's fucking dope. My eyebrows have become out of control and I don't know where my daughter hid the tweezers. So we're just fucking rolling with that until I go to Walgreens later. And I signed up for a six week challenge <clears throat> that I saw on Instagram. But it's actually like a thing here in the city that I live. And it's really funny because, so I signed up for it Apparently, it's a 42-day challenge. It's supposedly free. Tonight is the night I'm going to the info session. I'm gonna end up uploading a video tonight to get back on track with our days from the book and to, like, you know, do that. But I also want to tell you how tonight goes. So, 5.30 tonight, I have my first info session for this. And they give you a workout plan and a meal plan, which I have to see if they can, like, if I can do it eating a plant-based diet. I'm sure I can. It can't be that hard to swap shit out. Um, but what's funny is I get the confirmation text saying that they won't like give me the spot until I confirm that I'm coming. It's at I Love Kickboxing, which I don't know if I've ever gone into that on here. I Love Kickboxing is actually part of what started me on this whole journey like two or three years ago. Um, I signed up for the three free days on a whim 
ended up getting hella addicted to it part way like probably a month or two before I was done with my year of that is when I decided to sign up for CrossFit because I'd been wanting to do CrossFit for forever and then another year goes by and here we are so tonight I have the info meeting for that I'm really excited to let you know how that goes I'm fucking excited I don't know if it's just gonna be kickboxing I don't know cuz like the pictures from the Instagram ad looked like it might be like some type of boot camp type thing like I just wanted to get on here I wanted to say I'm super fucking sorry for being a crumb bum and just like being like fucking Amberlynn Reed like I know this whole challenge is me using Amberlynn's diet things but that, that wasn't supposed to mean that I turn even more into a bootleg version of her um but unlike Amberlynn we gonna we gonna turn this bitch around. Uh, I it's the twentieth. I have nine days until this month's diet bet ends, and ten days until round two of my six month diet bet ends. I've got about four pounds to lose. I think yeah, four pounds. I weighed in today at two eighteen point six. I think two eighteen point six. So. <sighs> We got this. We got this. We're starting a workout challenge. What's really cool is that this means that right up until basically the end of this challenge, I'm going to be going hard. And I know I was, before I was like, I'm not going to do any working out really besides random shit I can do at home because Amberlynn doesn't really work out. I think this will be good for me. I think that this will be another motivator, especially because I've been feeling down on myself for not, you know, consistently uploading. I feel like once I took that break from getting sick, I just like kind of fucked with my mental space and I don't want it to be like that. I want to continue this. I want to kick some ass. I want to become a skinny legend, you know? That's what I keep telling all my friends at work because they keep telling me like I look good and I'm like, oh, thank you. Just wait because come summertime. I'm going to be a skinny legend and y'all bitches ain't going to know what to do with me. Put my fake ponytail in and be just fucking out here with all the sass. <laughs> Let's go ahead and do all of my fucking weigh-ins now. Good morning, friends. Today, it is February 10th, day 41. Hello, Stephen. Two seventeen point six. Hey. Hello, friends. It is February eleventh, day forty two. Two twenty point four. It's literally so annoying. Hello, friends. It is February twelfth, which means it is day forty-three. Two twenty-two point two. Okay, it is. February 13th, day 44. Two twenty four, even fucking bollocks. Hello, friends. Today, oh God. It is February 14th. It is day 45. Happy Valentine's Day. I'm so skinny, I weigh nothing. Two twenty three point two. Okay, it is. 625 February 16th day 47 
2.16. Hello friends, today it is February 17th, day 48, Monday. Two fifteen point four. What? Hello, friends. It is February eighteenth, day forty nine. Two seventeen point four. Hello, friends. Today it is February 19th, which means it's day 50. <sighs> well, I was gonna weigh in. Two nineteen point two. Hello, Steven. Okay, it is February 20th, day 51. 218.6. Okay. Okay. As you saw, there was some ups, there was some downs. Honestly, I've been getting fucking a little discouraged from weighing myself every day, let's just say. But also not, because I like I have to remind myself weight fluctuates. The weekend I fucking run around a lot, don't drink enough water, so I'm always hella skinny, and then I start gaining ounces and pounds, ounces and pounds. But weighed in today at 218.6. So I think I have to lose like about four, about four pounds um, in the next nine days to meet my February diet bag goal. So I think that that's perfectly achievable, um, especially if I'm going to start working out and stuff. I need to get back to jump roping, especially now that I have my inhaler, so there's no excuse. But... Let's find our steps. Let's go to our steps. Okay, so I was in the process of going to look up all of the stuff of the info of my steps for my Fitbit and write it into our journal in. Um, and I got a notification. I got a notification that was a comment on one of my videos and that Yaba sent them and I had to of course run and to the YouTube underground. If you've never checked out her channel, check her out. She's one of my all-time favorite reaction channels. My boyfriend loves her, like he's especially her foodie beauty ones. Oh my god. But if you are here, I'm like, I'm sorry, I'm so fucking overwhelmed right now. So I was going to write my steps and do all of that to see where we're at towards our goal of a million. And I think I'm just going to save that for tonight's video because I'm feeling a little like, who? Um, yeah, we gave me a shout out. I messaged her when she said that she was taking like basically anyone could send in their channel and tell her about them and she'd give you it like she'd go through and look at them and give people a shout out so that we could help each other grow I'm fucking shook and I feel like if ever there was a sign from the universe telling me hey this track is the track you're supposed to be on making these changes changing your life this is the track you're supposed to be on if ever or oh, ever there was a sign it's me going to make a video and in the process getting a notification that someone shouted out my channel um i seriously <sighs> life is fucking crazy sometimes but those were my weigh-ins for the last, what, like 10 days that I've been gone or so. I don't know. I'm just, I'm freaking out a little bit, you guys. So I'm going to go 
clean or something or go maybe I'll go jump rope to like get this energy out I will be back later tonight pinky dinky promise Mwah. Mm. whole shebang um I will try and vlog if they let me vlog any of the info meeting and tonight I will get back with day 36 in our fucking book and We'll let you, and I'll let you know where we're at in our goal towards a million steps. Oh, fuck. Ah! If you liked this video, even though it's weird and rambly, and now I'm just, like, freaking out, um, leave me a comment below, like, subscribe if you're not already, hit the notification bell. If you're here because Yabba sent you, fucking thank you. You have no idea how much this means to me and seriously what a sign from the universe I am taking this as like <sighs> skinny legend 2020 here we fucking come I love you and I'll see you tonight